and dreams that from henceforth our people shall be governed not by arbitrary rule of the jackpot, but by the rules debated and agreed to by their own elected representatives and government. Hello and welcome to this special series on the political phenomenon in Nigeria. Now, without him, notes on political evolution will be incomplete, having contributed meaningfully to democracy in this country. Born in 1952, March 29 to be precise, Bola Ahmed Adekunle Tinubu, an accountant, is a Nigerian politician and a national leader of the All Progressives Congress, the APC. He was Lagos State Governor from 1999 to 2007. This series actually is not a catalogue of what he has done, but to be presenting to you those gentlemen and women who have passed through him. After all, there is no success without a successor. So, on each edition of the program, we shall be presenting to you a gentleman or lady who has worked closely with Tinubu. The program is therefore tagged Tinubu Maker of Men. Now, before we start profiling the Tinubu's men, let's meet the principal. Tinubu was the governor of Lagos State from 29th May 1999 to 29th May 2007 with two deputies, one after the other. First, Kofowurola Bruckner, then Femi Pedro. As the number one citizen of Lagos State, Tinubu was preceded by Buba Marwa and succeeded by Babatunde Fashola. Apart from the All Progressives Congress, Tinubu had other political affiliations like Social Democratic Party from 1992 to 1993, Alliance for Democracy 1998 to 2006, Action Congress of Nigeria 2006 to 2013. His wife is Senator Oluremi Tinubu. His mother, Abiba Tumogaji, was a trader that later became the Yaloja of Lagos. His political career began in 1992 when he joined the Social Democratic Party, where he was a member of the People's Front, the People's Front faction led by Sheo Musa Yaradwa, and made up of other politicians such as Omar Yaradwa, Atiku Abubakar, Babagana Kingibe, Rabiu Kwon Kwoso, Abdullahi Aliyu, Sumeila, Magaji Abdullahi, Dakpo Sarumi, and Yomi Edu. He was elected to the Senate representing Lagos West Senatorial District in the short-lived Nigerian Third Republic. After the annulment of the results of the 12th June 1993 presidential elections, Tinubu became a founding member of the pro-democracy National Democratic Coalition, NADECO, a group which mobilized support for the restoration of democracy and recognition of Moshuda Biola as winner of the 12th June election. Now, following the seizure of power by military head of state, General Sani Abacha, Tinubu went into exile in 1994 and returned to the country in 1998 after the death of military dictator, which ushered in the transition to the Fourth Nigerian Republic. In the run-up to the 1999 elections, Bola Tinubu was a protégé of Alliance for Democracy AD leaders Abraham Adesonia and Ayo Adebanjo. He went on to win the AD primaries of the Lagos State Governorship elections and defeated Fonsho Williams and Wahab Donshum, a former Minister of Works and Housing. In January 1999, he stood for the position of Governor of Lagos State on the AD ticket and was elected. During the eight-year period of his being in office, he made large investments in education in the state and also reduced the number of public schools in the state by returning many schools to the already settled former owners. He also initiated new road construction required to meet the needs of the fast-growing population of the state. Tinubu, alongside the new deputy governor Femi Pedro, won re-election into office as governor in April 2003. All other states in the southwest fell to the People's Democratic Party in those elections. He was involved in a struggle with the Olusegun Obasanjo controlled federal governments over whether or not Lagos State had a right to create new local council development areas, LCDAs, to meet the needs of its large population. 
The controversy led to the federal government seizing funds meant for local councils in the state. During the latter part of his term in office, he was engaged in continuous clashes with PDP powers such as Deshe Ogunlewe, a former Lagos State Senator who had become Minister of Works, and Bode George, the Southwest Chairman of the People's Democratic Party. Now relations between Tinubu and Deputy Governor Femi Pedro became increasingly tense after Pedro declared his intention to run for the gubernatorial elections. Pedro competed to become the AC candidate for the governor in the 2007 elections, but withdrew his name on the eve of the party nomination. He defected to the Labour Party while still keeping his position as deputy governor. Tinubu's tenure as Lagos State Governor ended on May 29, 2007, when his successor, Baba Tunde Fashola, of the Action Congress took office. In 2007, following the landslide victory of the People's Democratic Party PDP in the April 2007 elections, Tinubu was active in negotiations to bring together the fragmented opposition parties into a mega party capable of challenging the PDP. In February 2013, Tinubu's negotiations in creating a mega opposition party became paid off with the merger of Nigeria's biggest opposition parties, the Action Congress of Nigeria, ACN, the Congress for Progressive Change, CPC, the All Nigerian People's Party, ANPP, a faction of the All Progressives Grand Alliance, APGA, and the new PDP, NPDP, a faction of seven governors of the then ruling People's Democratic Party, into the All Progressives Congress, APC. In 2014, Tinubu supported former military head of state, General Muhammad Buhari, leader of the CPC faction of the APC, who commanded widespread following in northern Nigeria and had previously contested in the 2003, 2007, and 2011 presidential elections as the APC presidential candidate. In 2015, Buhari rode the APC into victory, ending the 16-year rule of the PDP and marking the first time ever in the history of Nigeria that an incumbent president lost to an opposition candidate. With that, we end the first episode in the series, Tinubu, Maker of Men. The second episode will feature the Nigeria's Vice President, Professor Yemi Yoshi Banjo. He served as Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice between 1999 and 2007 when Bola Tinubu was Governor. So, that will be all for now. Thanks for being there. I am Nten Epang. Bye-bye.